one of the most gut wrenching things in recruiting rankings is going to the all star games and then having to make decisions off of one event. And it looks like we're going to call Kelvin Banks wrong. He was a five star going into that event. He was phenomenal at the rivals camp in Dallas um, in the spring before his senior season. And then he went to the Under Armour game and really struggled at right tackle. Struggled is a kind word. Now, whether he was dealing with an injury, I had heard he had never played right tackle before, uh, or if he was just not used to that level of competition. We knocked him down to a high four-star. It's not like we plummeted him in the rankings, but we were sort of questionable if he should get a first-round grade with a five-star ranking after you know really struggling mightily at the Under Armour game against some really elite competition. It looks like we made the wrong call. If things continue this way, um, Texas's left tackle will be a first round draft pick, not only a first round draft pick, um, but probably uh, possibly at least, um, you know, the first offensive tackle off the board. Now, that will depend on the season that he has. It will depend on the pre-draft process. It will, it will depend on a whole lot of things um, going into the draft in 2025, which is basically a year away. But right now it looks like um, we should have kept Kelvin Banks as a five-star, not moved him down to four-star, and really used the Under Armour game as one measuring piece in, in a whole resume of work that Kelvin Banks had in his high school career.